heard the Gold Wing Express, you might have heard this song. John Wayne, good looking blue eyed man. If you knew our daddy, you could understand. Well, Mama fell head over heels of a plane to see. Yep. Who wrote that? I don't know. Rewrite it. the Viagra hairdo. You're gonna have to grow up someday, boy. He was a John Wayne good little blue-eyed oh! man. If you knew our daddy, you could understand. My mama fell head over heels, it was hard to see. Hard. But everybody said it was a downright sin, cause what they were doing wasn't done back then. Cause my mama was a full blooded a creek, you see. Oh! Call me a half breed, cause there ain't nothing wrong with that. I wear an eagle feather in my hat for the world to see. Full blooded half breed, both of my bloodlines are pure. I can tell you one thing for sure, I'm proud to be a full blooded half breed. Well, I learned how to hunt and I learned how to ride. Now my pony is a four wheel drive. Got a big townhouse, still on my little TV. Well, a three-piece suit don't fit me right But a buckskin jacket from a buffalo hide Feels good to my tailor-made shirts and my old blue jeans Call me a hat breed Cause there ain't nothing wrong with that I wear an eagle feather in my hat for the world to see Oh, but a hat breed Both of my bloodlines are pure I can tell you one thing for sure I'm proud to be A full-blooded hat breed Cherokee. 
Till the grave was closed and kept us warm Cover on our bed He was our strength and courage And he kept our people fed And he kept our people fed oh, yeah. He can't hear the thunder When the feet of the buffalo He can't see the wolf and the bear And the white tail like the bull Chokes on poison smoke, he can't fly no more. He can't fly no You gotta reach way down. Give me the Indian beat on the drum. Play the mandolin just like you do the drums, white man. Give me some Indian rhythm. Like a woodpecker Where the white man horse was made to run On oil and gasoline Those who came along and pushed Away the red man's dream Took away our freedom Our silver and our gold They're digging in the Indian graves Makes my blood run cold oh, And it makes my blood run cold oh, oh, hey. He can't hear the thunder From the feet of the buffalo He can't see the wolf and the bear And the white tail like the bull yeah. As the rain is falling From the sky to the ocean floor The eagle chokes on towards the smoke He can't fly no more He can't fly no more oh. Where are you to talk A good time so far? One more! One more, boy! One more! One more! All right, we'd like Sign to do this. Up on uh, that DVD. I need a Lexus payment. <sighs> oh, he, you mean it's messed up? I tell you, there's something wrong with him. It's made out of cat hair. It ain't real? Where'd you get it at? Walmart. Walmart? <laughs> Super Center. No, it's not real. I thought he grew it. It looks real. These women been looking at me up and down. You got it at Walmart? Uh-huh. Better return it. That one's got a hole in it. <laughs> I think it's made out of cat hair. <laughs> cat hair? I think so. Feels awful thin. Ooh, I know every night when Hot Lips runs her fingers through it, my rear end stands up. <laughs> Good to, see, good to see a couple of Ooh. our relatives here on the front huh? row. Relatives? We you mean you this guys. first table here? Oh, yeah. That's, that's a gambling table, isn't it? Have them stand up. Stand yeah, there up, they are. Family. Hey, good to see you, boys. Right here in the that's blue That's the boys' uncles you, right yeah, there. Stand, stand up, up, uncles. Get, Get up. up. Yeah, you know who you are. Get oh. up, both of you. I want you on a DVD tonight. Yeah, stand those up. are Uncle Apaches. Apache here and Apache there. <laughs> More Dobro? Give me that Yeah, dobro. I'm sick and tired of that. Yeah, yeah I play Dobro. I'll tell you what, we're so glad to be down back this way. We got uh, four different 
uh, locations that we're playing actually this weekend. Last night we was over in Fort Myers area. Tonight here we are. Tomorrow we'll be up in Palatka, Florida. Palatka is, I guess, an Indian name for bump it or bumper. <laughs> we'll be up there with Ricky Skaggs, Rhonda Vincent, Ralph Stanley, and all of them uh, people. If y'all ain't got anything going, come up there at Palatka, Florida. Big music festival. We'll be a part of that tomorrow. And then, uh, see, that's on Friday. That's tomorrow. And Saturday we'll be down in uh, a place called Sebring. Where's that? Yep, the RV resort that we're playing at down there. And, uh, hey, listen, we uh, would like to do this song here for you guys. Y'all want to hear a little more Dobro? I'm going to fix the port on you. Hey, tell them about our festival next year. Tell them, tell them. We had a real good bluegrass festival oh, for the very first time. you should have been time. there. There's a lot of people. La next year, it'll be the first weekend in February down in Arcadia. Mm -hmm. It only lasts three days. It's dr all dry camping unless it rains or, you know. <laughs> but we want y'all to... We want y'all to really uh, keep that date in mind. It's the first weekend in February. We had our first one this year, and it was a big success. success. And uh, we'd like to invite you to be a part of that next year. Keep those dates in mind. First weekend in February when you come back down south here, down in Arcadia, Florida, at Craig's RV Park. Had a wonderful. Yes. Boy, the weather was cold down there. I tell you what, though, they got a big pavilion in case there's any falling weather. You can get up and under there and stay warm. Bring you a blanket. Bring you a woman with you. If you don't know one, find one. Hey, here's a song we picked up. Hadn't been doing it long. Hope you enjoy this. Don't forget, go over and get you one of them DVDs. Boy, they good. I gotta find my bar. Pocket knife back. <laughs> I think Vince, I think Vince took it. Silver coin, that jingle jangle, fancy shoes, the dancing kind. Oh, the secrets of her dark eyes, may they sing. A gypsy rhyme, yellow clover, entangled blossom, give her in a mess, stage hand to hand, silky green, where she held me to her bosom, just a boy of seventeen. I recall the gypsy woman, silver span. As we lay there against the moonlight In the taste of life's sweet wine <laughs> Oh yeah, play it son Dad, if all else fails Just get up there and say, hello darling Soft breezes blow from the fragrant meadow, stir the darkness in my mind. Old oh, woman, lay beside me, listen to these words of mine. Gypsy lady, I hear your laughter, invitations in her head. As my tender wife and baby slumber softly in their bed, I recall the gypsy woman, silver spangled in her eyes, as we lay there against the moonlight in the taste of life's sweet wine. Are you ready? Spangles in her eyes as we 
lay there against the moonlight in the taste of life's sweet wine in the taste of life's sweet wine thank you We're going home on this one, boy. This will be for you that wanted the dobro. Brother Bashful Oswald did on the Nash Nashville. You gonna make it cry? Make it cry here, boy, in Auburndale, Florida. Bring out the tears, just like you did on your mother-in-law. Look at it. How about a hand for the Dobro man? Woo! Well, folks, you've been a wonderful audience. Uh oh. one of them little bug-eyed looking weirdo creatures give me a hot note boy you asked for it you're gonna get it here it goes Sound man. Sound man eating. I had a longer cord than this when I was born.
Chihuahua. They're a teenage mutant engine puppy. Sir, don't you hate them little bug-eyed looking weird old creatures? Guess he can't hear. They look like a Doberman pincher with air let out of them. My little grandbaby wanted one of them. I looked up at her, I said, honey, do you think you really need a mouse that's been fed steroids? Made a long tour down here in Florida. Saved up all my money, bought her one. Chihuahua? Brought it back and gave it to her. She said, Papa, thank you. Let's call him Spot. I said, there ain't enough dog there. Better call him Speck. <laughs> Had a tornado to come through where we live. We live in a small place close to Branson now. 250 people. Never gets any bigger, never gets any smaller. Every time there's a newborn baby, somebody leaves town. Sir, I think I recognize you. <laughs> Tore up every outhouse in town. The boy's mother at that time was living. Speck, me. We'd go riding, seeing what was being built. Speck was so small, I throwed him in the back seat. He couldn't look out over the back glass, so I had to describe to him what was going up. I really thought I was doing good till one morning the boy's mama pointed out, said, Bob, you realize that dog's Mexican? <laughs> I don't think he understands the word you're saying. So I went straight to Walmart, bought him some suction cups, put them on his feet and stuck him to the back glass. <laughs> oh, he could ride up there for hours. <laughs> He'd get a little bit nervous when I'd go to roll the back glass down. Only reason was I had him riding on the outside. <laughs> Won't be long, boys. We'll take all this money back from Florida. Vince has given us. <laughs> to the bank. Speck left, loves to go to the bank. Likes to go to the bank. Huh? Oh, I know they got him here much money as they got in Florida. You know them suction tubes that runs through the bank? I left to put speck inside of one of them. <laughs> you ought to see his eyes bug out going through that bank. Hey, you know the women's got to where they don't want to see me coming, but I don't blame them, boy. Speck is like you and me. Every time he goes into the bank, he thinks you ought to leave a deposit. <laughs> Would you give our daddy a nice hand there for telling about the Chihuahua? Hey, you're a great audience. God bless you tonight. Hey, listen, uh, Dad, let me make a couple of announcements. You boys tone it down just a little bit. Tone it down. 
A lot of folks want to know how long you guys been doing this. Some of you have seen us come up the hard way. It's exactly what we've done, too. Today's no different. We're just having a lot more shows out there, and we're still having a lot of fun. Our dad put us in this music business probably 20 years ago. We've seen a lot of changes, seen a lot of, a lot of different parts of the United States. We're still on the road today by the good help of the good Lord. And also, for you folks out there that have bought in our products down through the years. This is how we stay alive. This is our livelihood right out here on the road. We feel like we got something to share to folks. We feel like we got something like this next song that maybe might touch somebody's heart. So by the grace of the good Lord, we're still out here on the road. And after the show is over, if you folks would, stop over there, pick up a copy of this show on DVD. A DVD is something that you can stick in there and you can watch over and over and over and over again. It's a great gift. If you'll spend $20 on our table, we'll give you a free DVD. The $20, you'll get two CDs. You'll get two CDs for $20, and you'll also receive a free DVD of tonight's performance. If you'd like to take advantage of that, come on back there to our record table as soon as we get off stage. It only takes about 10 minutes, and we'll start passing them out one by one. This song right here means a lot to our group, means a lot to our family, and I hope y'all enjoy this particular song. Listen to the words. It goes like this. He can run 20 of those off in five minutes, so it don't take long. Make sure you get over and place your order. You've been a wonderful audience. We love you people. Thank you for having us, Ben. We love you, buddy. We've worked with that man for a few years. There's not a better man to work with. Well, I'm going to live forever. I'm going to cross that river. I'm going to live eternal. You're going to want to hold me just like I've always held you. You're going to miss me when I'm gone. Please try to raise your children right Don't let the darkness take them Don't let them feel forsaken Just lead them safely to the light When this old world is blown asunder And all the stars fall from the sky Remember Jesus really loves you We'll live forever years ago my mother she pulled me to the side one day she said son I want you to listen to this song as I play it for you so she got the cassette tape she put it in this little tape player I didn't really know exactly what she was talking about at that time I guess she wanted me to listen to the words and I didn't really catch on to what she was saying today I know what she was talking about the song pertains to her and her lifestyle especially there towards the end I'm gonna live forever. I'm gonna live forever. I'm gonna cross the river. I'm gonna live eternal. You're gonna to wanna to hold me just like I've always held you. You're gonna miss me when I'm gone. Nobody here will ever find me, but I will always be around. Just like 
Our mother's no longer with us today. She passed away about nine years ago. Folks, it's just a temporary goodbye. Someday we'll get to see Mom again. When that opportunity comes, I'm going to look right into her eyes and say, Mom, we sure have missed you and we sure love you. What a joyous occasion that that's going to be. I know everybody here has lost a loved one. Someday we'll be reunited with them. Now, folks, I'm not here to preach at you tonight. I don't want to sound like that, but I want to take just a quick moment and tell you a, a quick thing that happened in our personal life. My, I got a daughter. She's 15 years old. And at that age, they're subject to all kinds of temptations that might be out there. They're subject at school for alcohol, drugs, sex, anything like that. <clears throat> Towards the first part of the year, uh, 2009, we were over in Georgia. I spend a lot of time away from the house. So my kids are back at the house and I'm out on the road. But anyway, she called me up. We were doing shows up in Jekyll Island, Georgia. It was about 2 o'clock, 2.15 a.m. Well, I'd sent her on uh, an opportunity to go to a church camp down there. And so she calls me up. She went to Alabama and I went to Georgia. And she says, Dad, you'll never guess what happened to me. I said, what's that, sweetie? She said, I found Jesus. So that hit home. So when she told me that, oh, I just started crying. You know, tears started welling up in my ears. Sometimes she'll come home and she'll tell me things that go on in the public school systems. Now, friends, I don't know about you or what relationship that you have with your, your grandkids or your children. But our public school systems, they're in trouble. So I encourage you tonight just to keep that in mind and might say a prayer for the, our school system all of our young people they are the future and so I really do take that to heart but I just praise the good Lord tonight that he still is on the move and he watches out for our young folks while we're here on this old earth with everything that's going on and every time you turn on the news, something else is going on. I do firmly believe inside of my heart while we're still here, the United States of America and Canada, they are still the best place in the whole wide world to live. <laughs> Tonight we are honored by the men and women that have made this country into what it is today. Tonight our dad, you know, he served in the army and he was a veteran of our military. Tonight, if we could, if we could just have one representative, maybe one from the army, one from the navy, one from the air force, and one from the marine corps, if you could join my pop right here on the front of the stage and as they come, would y'all give him a nice big hand. I don't know these guys, but there's something about these men right here that sure, they send, a, they send a tingling up and down my spine. How about a nice hand for the United States Army? Would you raise your hand? United States Air Force. United States Navy. The United States Marine Corps. The United States Merchant Marine. Coast Guard, the National Guard, all the men and women that are still away from their homes tonight that is protecting this country, the men and women that are still fighting for this country and keeping us safe, would you please give them and honor them and give them a nice hand. Please help us sing this last song.
to get your DVD live. I, um... Uh,